I founded Center for Severe Weather Research about 13 years ago, and I did that so we could independently operate mobile radars, which I had invented several years before. CSWR was one of the largest groups in Pecan, and we operated three Doppler on wheels, three mobile mesonets, 10 or 15 deployable weather stations called pods. We launched soundings. The DC-8 from NASA was involved, and that's a huge research aircraft that is able to stay up for a long time and study things in situ, things we can't see from the ground. The goal of PECAN, like many weather studies, is to try to understand a particular phenomenon better. And usually it's true that if we understand something better, we can predict it better. And that's not just true in meteorology. It's true in almost every field of endeavor. Better understanding leads to better forecasts, which really leads to human impact, positive human impact, where people can have better warnings, they can more finely tune their lives. There were about 100 people out in Pecan. Dozens of them now are scientists and grad students, engineers, software engineers who are looking through all the terabytes of data that were collected. Probably even 10 years from now, people will be looking at pecan data and still learning things from it because there's such great data sets. So the process is going to take years, but it's just beginning and we're very excited by it.